Hi, my name is Mar and I'm a black girl. Okay, so recently I was, um, you know, perusing the aisles of the local Asian market. I saw some interesting things on the shelving that they had there. They had some like interesting looking foods and I was like, guess who wants to try that? So your home girl picked up a couple snacks that she thought looked interesting. Okay, so since I thought I'm eating these anyway, I'm just gonna eat them on camera. Just in case you were like, hey, I wanted to try those too. Or hey, I already tried that and I enjoyed it. Or you didn't enjoy it and wanna see someone else enjoy or not enjoy that set product. But anyways, let's get started. So, um, uh, I'm gonna need a table. So, obviously this uh, was well worth the money because it came in clutch for about two videos now. Okay, so we, let me not crinkle the bag in your ear. So I got about five snacks and we're just gonna pull them out and see what we got. We're gonna try, um, Mm. This, uh, I don't know how to read Japanese, so it was cute. Look at these eyes. Look at them. It said, bitch, eat me. And I was like, <laughs> don't mind if I do. So we're gonna open this. Shnurp. And uh, eat these hoes, defeat these hoes. <laughs> Okay, honestly, um, it smells like a, a gummy. I don't know, I'm, I'm, I'm getting scared. I'm not a picky eater, but I, I tend to get scared of foods I don't know how to pronounce. So, there's that. Let's just try it. This is what it looks like. It looks like a little, a little bottle. Ooh, I'm scared. You see that? I'm becoming such a freaking YouTuber. Look at me with a hand in front of the camera. Look at me go. Okay, I'm stalling. Hey. Okay. I'm sorry. I hate chewing sounds. Especially when people chew with their mouth open. I kill those people. Reminds me of like cream soda or something. <gasps> oh. Maybe that's what it's supposed to be. It's supposed to be like cream soda. Oh, here it goes. Here's the name of it. Gummy candy. Cherry gummy nakusankin. So that's what that is. Mm -hmm. All right, next one. Honestly, I've tried this before. Pocky. Shit's fire. So I just, I haven't had it in a long time. But, uh, and to be honest, I just really wanted some Pocky. Behold, the Pocky. Awesome, still tastes great. So I got, I got this stuff. Um, and the last one had the name on the back. So let's look at that first. Bean cracker, main mix. Oh, that doesn't sound very appealing at all. But, um, you know, we're troopers. And I just thought this looked weird. So let's just go ahead and open that up. Not all the way, because I don't trust my taste palette. But um, we're just gonna try some. You never know. You'll see what's in here. Peanut, bro. That's the first ingredient. I hate peanuts, bro. Hello, darkness, my old friend. Whatever, bro. We still, we're troopers. I ain't no punk. We're gonna try it. We're just gonna try it. I wonder if I have to try, should I try each one of these little pieces? I should, I should. I should give every little piece a chance. Oh. <coughs> oh, it smells like peanuts. Damn, bro. Get here. This nigga don't wanna be eaten. Okay, all right, all right. What did you? Sure. I think I got all the possible pieces in this. I don't know if you guys can like see all the little pieces. This guy, this guy, this guy, this guy, this guy. Oh, you better focus. Right off the bat, oh. It smells like caramel corn. Okay. Okay, my okay, okay, okay. 
I like caramel corn. Oh, is it, is it my hand? No, that one smells like caramel corn too. Okay, I'm gonna set those two pieces aside because I have a feeling those are gonna be my pieces, okay? That one really doesn't have a smell. Oh, that one's a peanut, bro. That one's a straight up peanut, bro. Ooh, my Jesus. I'm just gonna try them each individually just to really get the taste and the texture of them. So, I'm just gonna start off with the ones that smell like the peanuts because I know I'm not gonna like those, so. Let's get those mugs over with. Oh, all right, the little orange things, they taste like, you know those little square things in Chex Mix? Okay, I'm gonna put it right here. And if I don't, um, this part of the video is just gonna look really silly. But okay, that's what it tastes like. On to um, the next one. Oh, nigga, this is the one that smells like a peanut, bro. You can't really taste anything. Ooh, bro. I... Oh! <laughs> That's a motherfucking peanut. Mm, I can't do it. I can't. I can't. I hate. Mmm. <coughs> mmm. I hate peanuts, bro. I, I hate a nut, bro. I hate a nut, bro. Do I have to eat it? I feel like this is... Mm. I'll think about it. I'll I'll think about that one. Let's move on to the next one. Oh, it's so crunchy. Uh. <sighs> there's a peanut in the middle, bro. Oh, there's a peanut in the middle, bro. Okay. I have this. I, I don't know. This, uh, it tastes like sushi? Okay. Go go ahead and snatch him up. He looks delicious. All right, ready? One, two. Nigga was crunchy. I went through um, several different moods through that experience. I guess I liked it. Moving on. This little number. Doesn't she look delish? Like, this looks so yummy. This looks so cute. This right here is an aesthetic. Chocolate chip melon roll. At the beginning of this video, I know I said um, I wasn't particularly a picky eater, but the things I don't like, I don't like. Peanuts, melons, bananas, and tomatoes. They're disgusting, I hate them. And right now, I'm getting like, I'm hitting two food groups of the things I don't like. If this has melon in it, I'm gonna be upset. <laughs> It's filled with chocolate, okay? I thought I was about to open it up and find some freaking watermelon in here. I was about to be devastated. That's good. I just um, really wanna thank the Lord for not giving me two nasty snacks in a row. Never would've made it, never could've made it. Without you. All right, last snack. Drink. Um, I saw this. It looks fun. Um, and I thought, hey, I'm a fun girl. This is a fun drink. Let's do it. Oh, it's carbonated, and it's in the flavor strawberry. Okay. Excuse all the sniffling. I have like some kind of cold, some kind of virus. So, y'all see that cap? Like. Give me a hickey, bro. What is this? I thought this was a lid. What, bro? Okay, at the top, I have this little marble in there. I don't think it twists off, but like, I think you just pop that hoe in. Like, like, maybe like, like. <laughs> oh shoot, do you twist it off? Is that just there for decor? No, it definitely does not twist. How do you get this mug in there? Oh. Oh, do you push this? No. How? How? Yo, how am I supposed to open this? Bro, how? Uh, am I doing anything? Is it going in? How do I do this? Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Woo. <laughs> Haters can't stop me, bro. Okay, so the thing that I thought was the lid, the actual lid, has a middle that you can poke out, okay? And this looks like a marble sized metal. So let's just slip that bad boy in there, like so. Oh shoot. 
Gotta put this down on the table. How do Asians do this? It should not be this hard for me to get a sip of some drinky drink. Oh, oh, was that get it out? Yeah, look, the marble's in there. You guys see it? Whoa. Okay, let me stop playing. Oh, first of all, it tastes like a red Fanta right here. This freaking marble, bro. Mmm, Jesus. All right, this this freaking marble bro is like coming up to the top preventing me from drinking this stuff bro mm, mm, mm. all right on that note i'm done all right guys thank you so much for going on this culinary journey with me i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you next time bye